<sighs> What's up everybody, it's Tim Chow again. Today is gonna be a video about how to launch a boat. Today is just me and then we have my brother and my brother-in-laws. They're gonna be helping, helping out to launch a boat. It's easier with two people. If it's by yourself, I prefer to use a rope. Um, otherwise, what you wanna do first, make sure that you have everything out of the car that you wanna put in the boat. And then you're gonna come to your back right here. You're gonna make sure that these straps right here are off. And then since I'm using a motor mate, we're gonna want to lift up the engine. And get this out of the way. And then my brother, he he plugged in the whole most important one right there. Make sure that's plugged in and twisted. And you come on this side and then you unstrap that part. So I like to do a sweep from the left to the right. I have my little baby right here too. Hi Loki. Hi Loki. And after that, um, if, if you have another person with you, they could, and if they know how to back up a boat, you usually have them back up the boat, which my brother Daniel right here was gonna back up the boat. Oh, and you also wanna make sure that your live well is closed so that way water won't be flowing up. Oh, what's also an important thing to get your boat ready to for startup is to make sure that you pump oil or that you pump gas in your boat. So you wanna keep pumping till you feel that your bubble is tight. And yep, mine is tight enough. And yeah, there you go. Yep, you're good to go. And so when he backs up the boat, he's gonna back up straight into this launch so if you're trying to get the boat to your right you turn the wheel to your left so the boat's gonna go opposite to where you turn my brother Dale turns right the boat's gonna go left turns left the boat's gonna go right one important thing I forgot was to turn on the batteries Ugh. so for the way the boat to start uh, you gotta turn your batteries on which I have all my breakers off. Okay, now I see a little bit better. All right, and then you're good. So he's backing up straight into the ramp. If you're by yourself, it's always good to tie a rope at the bow, at the hole right there, and then onto your trailer when you back up so that way your boat can flow off the uh, trailer but won't float too far then you can pull your boat to the uh, dock yeah I will keep going and so depending on your boat if it's a fiberglass it's safer to unlatch your boat right here are you good hold on normally I've seen people normally I've seen people unlatch their boat if it's a fiberglass early earlier than this phase but i usually like to unlatch it here just to keep it safe if you have an aluminum boat i would advise you guys to wait until your boat is a little bit halfway in the water before you uh launch all the way in in the water so otherwise so after we unstrap it i get on the boat quick and easy <sighs> So I'm on the boat and then you tell your driver that he's good to go. So make sure that your safety switch is on run so that way the boat will start. So for ours we have to push in. That's with the choke. And then once the motor hits the water you can turn it on. There we go, got it on. And then, you, you can keep coming down a bit more. More. Ah, you're good. And then you can back up the boat off the trailer like this. Really easy with a partner. If you're by yourself again, you're gonna have to do a rope or you could loosen your winch all the way so that your boat could come off nicely. 
So now we just gotta get our people on the boat now. And then here we go, that's it. That's how you launch off a boat really quickly with two or more people.